Hello again, this is Robert Veach here, and this is my video review of a Cobb LED grow light. Manufacturer and seller is Romance Link. Now this is unique for several reasons. It has a Cobb full spectrum LED in the center that has an individual control knob for that. And then these LED arrays are 10 watts, and there's blue 450 to 460 nanometer, red 620 to 630 nanometer. There is an adjustable knob for those also. They are dual channel LEDs, and uh, most other ones are just one LED, five watts. These are dual LEDs, 10 watts. Now this whole unit is compliant by FCC and CE certification and ROHS. So you know that it's safe to use and it's uh, been tested. Now the seller manufacturer provides a 36 month warranty and return policy. You can't beat that. So comes with a little instruction manual and a power cord that is five feet long. And it's also a very flexible power cord. And it comes with straps that go onto the back of the unit and allow you to hang it right here. And your power cord goes in right there. It only fits one way. Here's your main power switch on and off, just right there. Then if you look at the top, we're gonna turn this around. And you can see that you have a vegetable setting or veg and a bloom setting. And then it has numbers, it's all calibrated. Very nice control. You have a very simple method to control the light output of these. And uh, we're gonna power this up and show you that. And it has a powerful internal fan that draws air in this way and exits the air on each one of these side panels, which will allow the cooling of the cob light as well as these 10 watt or dual LED lights all on there. The reason why this is unique is that the angle of this combined with these produces a really nice PAR output and coverage. Now PAR is the parabolic um, anodization reflection and that comes from the original term from uh, halogen lights, but it's still used for LEDs. So what that means is that this is gonna have a very nice even disbursement of the light to allow you to grow your plants. Now this fully adjustable control, it goes from veggie all the way to bloom. And with that blue or red spectrum, you can have full control of the different growing stages of your plant. And you could research what plant you have and see what percentage of this you're gonna need for those different growing stages. The fan also inside here is variable speed, depending on the requirements of how much is needed. So it will use minimal amount of power to keep this unit cool. And also it has very large heat sinks inside here that provide some of the dissipation of the heat and that's where the air comes out to properly dissipate the unit. Now the uh, amount of light that this produces and the angle of that comes out of it, you wanna go six inches away up to 30 inches away. Now at six inches, it's gonna produce about 937 lux, and uh, that's six inches or 15.2 centimeters. At um, 30 inches, it's gonna produce, or 60 or 76.1 centimeters, it's gonna produce about 271 lux. And it's doing this all by just drawing 110 watts, even though it's the equivalent of 1200 watts. So because of this efficiency, these things don't draw much energy, which is what you want. So we're gonna power this up and we're gonna show you the controls on here. Okay, so I have the plug powered on and I have the switch turned on and both these controls are counterclockwise. So if I turn the bloom, it starts to produce color and you have control of the amount. And you notice the fan starts increasing. and that's gonna allow this thing to cool down. Now, independent of that, we have the veg setting, and that produces the cob full spectrum light, which is in the center right there, and it starts bringing in 
some of the blue lights and you have full control of that there. So when you do both knobs, you're blending in both of those lights. Very simple to operate and you have full control from zero to 100%. This is a very accurate control. So you can experiment with your plants and get it just right. So let's talk about efficiency. I have a watt meter hooked up to the device. Now this produces 1200 watts equivalent of LED light. But look at how many watts it's only consuming. It's com consuming 127 watts. And that's where you get into the efficiency of LEDs. The actual efficiency of this is 76.692 lumens per watt. And that tells you that this is efficient. It's not producing heat. And that's all it's drawing from your wall outlet. So it's gonna save you money compared to any other type of light. So once you hook those up, make sure that you have the small part there on the top, and then you could lift this up and hang this wherever you're gonna have your plants. And you can see it's very nicely balanced and it's gonna hold the thing in place and allow you to grow your plants. Okay, I've been running the light on the largest amount of energy full veg and full bloom for about 20 minutes and the fan is taking in air and extruding the air on both sides so let's just do a little temperature test to see how it's doing so if i go to the front i got a temperature gun here if i go to the front it shows 120 let's see 121 degrees and 207 and 20 so that's right on the cob bright led and and then if i measure the temperature of the aluminum right here 97 and if i go to the side and measure the air coming out it's about 91 degrees 97 on the top and 91 on the side let's move this over Sorry about that, 97, 96. So the air coming out of here is extruding the heat from the front of this LED light, keeping this relatively cool. Now most LEDs will work without failure up to about 160 degrees. So what this is doing, it's taking the heat away by taking the incoming air and dispersing it out this way and keeping those LEDs cool so that you don't have to worry about failure. That's a really good design. So what do I think about the Cobb LED Grow Light model OA-OFAS10? I like this product. It's the first one I've seen that has these dual controls. I like the profile that it is smaller and not so big and the lights disperse properly. And as you can see, it worked with my seedlings. It worked perfectly. I like the fan cooling of this. I like the way it looks, the color, the build quality of these of these controls is very nice. So I'm gonna give this product a full five star rating on my channel. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helps you with your buying decisions. Thank you for watching.